just a quick recap to take the evaporator core out of a Toyota Land Cruiser 1994 you first remove two 10 millimeter bolts at the back of these the liquid side and the gas side and once you remove those bolts they just pull straight out come they back straight out no problem make sure that you replace these o-rings when you put it back in there's two o-rings um, you're done on the inside of the engine compartment now I don't have I didn't videotape the dash being taken apart when I say dash when the glove compartment is removed um, it's not hard and then here's your uh, your rail for the bottom of the glove compartment it's got to be loose at least on one side once you do that then you come in here and you pull that bolt now these are underneath the the uh, the unit the cooling unit itself there's there's one bolt two bolts three bolts four bolts and two nuts one here and one here now you have to pull the computer to do that there's one bolt there one bolt here and uh, those are easy to take out so just pull the computer just let it hang out of the way um, you just take take the computer out take those five one two three four five yeah one two three four five five or six um, bolts out and then the unit just slides straight back it'll come out fairly easy once you've disconnected it all the way so uh, just be a little careful and just just pull these off and I don't I don't think I've heard that you don't want to damage any of this stuff because um, the replacement cooling box itself is supposed to be expensive but you won't damage it just take it a little bit slow um, there is my Evaporator core. There's two Allen wrenches here. Make sure you replace the O rings. Um, as you can see, pretty substantial leak. That's where all my freon was going. Plus, not to mention all the debris. Um, cooling box as it sits in the vehicle. Like I said before, one, two, three, four, five. And then you just, once you get this out, you just pull it apart and by removing, removing three clips. One, this is the front side. One, two, three, and then one, two, three, four uh, screws pops right apart. You take the thing out, you go get another heater core. Um, like I said, these things, I found one for $150. Uh, this from the dealership is $274. Um, Nissan makes most of these that i found the one from the dealership was the same as the 150 dollars piece so anyway um you may want to play replace the receiver as well that's what a lot of people are saying so that's 58 dollars um i guess you probably want to do it as well it's pretty easy it just comes right apart it's, it's located at the front of your vehicle Right there, actually. And I think it comes apart pretty easy. I haven't taken it apart yet, but I'll check it out. And that is it. See you later. That's the Evaporator Core 1994 Toyota Land Cruiser.